so it must have been a day where in like the children's classes or something they were either doing something about hell or sin or something because when I walked outside um, there was this really short little girl. I mean, I think she must have been like five or six. And you could tell from her eyes, she had been just crying. Oh my gosh, this poor little girl was so sad. And she was talking to Father Philip. And um, I could kind of hear some of their conversation because what he was doing was explaining about, you know, um, how, how it would feel like if you were in the presence of God that you couldn't accept or recognize him and that, that that's why you would feel him as... Um, as an as a bad entity or something like or flames of fire or something whatever he said and i was thinking oh no a horrified child see and this is like exactly <laughs> what like An angie the antitheist always talks about is like the worst thing ever you know to terrify a child or um then okay as so if i thought it was over right no we walk into the little area oh my hair is doing weird things um and there's this little boy who's asking him about sin and he's like how is it exactly what happens to your soul when you sin and the description he gave was really very beautiful um and i just felt like oh my gosh i just want to walk around behind him and hear all these <laughs> descriptions um it was something about how that a soul t uh, sin takes soul uh, separates the soul from the body i think that was what he said it was just an interesting thing i, I got it when i was there but as if i could remember it now but um <laughs> Yeah, it must have been like a really rough day in <laughs> their, their uh, little children's classes because there were some tears of confusion. So, yeah, I guess that's that.